As we descend, the sun's rays are absorbed and scattered. At 200 meters, we leave the photic zone and enter the first layer of the deep sea, the twilight zone. At this depth, there's less than 1% of the sunlight at the surface. The pressure has increased 20-fold and the temperature has dropped to four degrees. But we find a world of extraordinary beauty. With nowhere to hide in the twilight zone, the best disguise is transparency. Like this squid with a delicate glass-like body. Almost nine centimeters long, this amphipod is a giant of its kind. It's completely transparent apart from its two enormous eyes and central nervous system. Another peculiar crustacean lives like a hermit within the stolen body of a jellyfish. This shell also houses her offspring. Her habit of pushing this protective shell around has led to the nickname of pram bug. The longest jellyfish of all are the giant siphonophores. Their tentacles, lined with rows of stinging cells, can reach 40 meters long. Of the countless billions of animals living below the photic zone, only a fraction migrate into shallower water to feed at night. So what do these animals feed on? Looking out of the window of our submersible, we can see a constant rain of particles slowly drifting down around us. Known as marine snow, this is a vital food source for everything living below 200 meters. It rains down from the sunlit waters above, 